Hi, my name is Morgan Handel. And my name is Jessica Gardenier. And we did our presentation on the American Institute of Certified Public Accountants, otherwise known as the AICPA. The history of the AICPA is long and a little confusing because they have rebranded themselves under several different names over the years. The AICPA first began in 1887 under the name the American Association of Public Accountants, and then in 1916 they were rebranded into the Institute of Public Accountants, and again in 1917 they changed to the American Institute of Accountants. In 1936, a separate accounting entity, the American Society of Certified Public Accountants, merged with the American Institute of Accountants, and then finally in 1957 the conglomerate changed its name to what it is known as today, which is the American Institute of Certified Public Accountants. The most widely known responsibility of the AICPA is developing and grading the CPA exam. The CPA is taken by accounting professionals striving to achieve the Certified Public Accountant accreditation, which is typically something that all accounting professionals strive for. The AICPA does not just develop the exam itself, though. They are also in charge of the exam preparation process that leads up to it. They offer many training programs, informational seminars, and practice examination materials for people getting ready to take their CPA test. The AICPA is also in charge of standards on ethics and professional integrity for accounting professionals, which can be seen in the association's rules on independence and objectivity. The AACPA also serves to benefit accounting professionals through undertaking and sharing research with accounting professionals around the country. Finally, the AACPA prepares and curates publications on matters related to the accounting industry to assure that professionals stay up to date with current events, recent regulations, and practice management techniques. The AICPA has widespread impacts on other organizations that aren't always related to the accounting profession. The AICPA has relations with the IRS, SEC, PCAOB, U.S. Department of Labor, the court system, the State Board of Accountancy, and state CPA societies. And as you can see from this graph, this is a two-way relationship with the AICPA impacting them and these entities equally impacting the AICPA. Because the scope of the AICPA extends so far, the AICPA has a strong pull over the professional accounting industry and is instrumental in ensuring ethical conduct, granting accreditation, and research, and overall progression of the integrity of the accounting profession. It would be wrong to think that the AICPA's impact is limited only to accounting, and it is important that people remember how interconnected the accounting industry is with every element of our society. The historical buildup of the AACPA led itself to being defined as the world's largest member association representing the accounting profession, and it incorporates members from diverse areas of practice such as business, government, public practice, education, and consulting, all coming together for the betterment of the accounting profession. The AACPA in total has 418,000 members coming from 143 countries. All members depend on the uniform CPA examination, which only adds to the impressive nature and integrity of this professional exam in the AACPA as a professional organization. Some more statistics pertaining to the impressive scale of the AICPA include the fact that 150,000 firms and businesses employ AICPA members, and the AICPA themselves have 35 physical office locations. It is also important to note that the AICPA is not only in charge of the CPA, there is another premier designation that they are in charge of, and that is the Chartered Global Management Accountant Licensure, aka the CGMA. And in addition to that, there are 17 specialized credentials and certificates offered, such as the Chartered Global Management Accountant and Certified Information Technology Professional. Because of its immense responsibilities, the AACPA has a strong mission statement. The mission of the organization is fourfold, continuity, resources, excellence, and service. Continuity stands for the rigorous learning of members, testing of CPAs, ongoing competency development, and continuous focus on ethical behavior. Resources are equally important as they represent focus on giving accounting professionals the necessary resources to succeed. Specifically, the organization is committed to understanding the skills necessary to meet today's demands and tomorrow's challenges. Additionally, the AICPA states that the organization will drive excellence within the accounting profession. And finally, the AICPA's mission reflects the value of service to the public. The organization is committed to protecting public interest and serving a multitude of philanthropic causes and participating in giving back to communities. It is important that the AICPA organizes itself in order to divide responsibilities and specialize in niche areas of concern. The very first committee was established before the group had even named itself, and this committee was responsible for drafting rules and regulations pertaining to the accounting profession. Then, with the creation of their bylaws in 1897, three formal committees were established. 
the Finance and Audit Committee, the Committee on Elections, Qualifications and Examinations, and the Committee on Bylaws. These three initial committees grew exponentially through the years, growing from 34 committees in the 40s, 89 in the 60s, 109 in the 70s, and finally, in 1999, the number of committees had reached a whopping 120. At this point, they realized that such a large number of committees spread their organization too thin, and they needed a reorganization of their committee structure. Eventually, they replaced about half of the standing committees with a volunteer group model, which allowed them to refocus on specific tasks with niche objectives that could be dissolved once the objective was completed, and this allowed them to overall work more efficiently and effectively. The AICPA puts a strong focus on working solely in the public interest through the success of global businesses. They strive to do this by providing the most relevant knowledge, resources, and advocacy to CPAs, CGMAs, and others with various specialty credentials. In fact, the organization states that from financial literacy to public policy issues and peer review transparency to audit committee effectiveness, the AACPA is working to ensure that the public remains confident in the integrity, objectivity, competence, and professionalism of CPAs. The AACPA is responsible for putting provisions into place that shield the public from fraud, inexperienced, and uninformed professionals, and misleading reporting, which is wildly important to the operation of business. Because of the widespread nature of their impact, it is important that the AICPA has clearly defined values that represent their goals and aspirations. Amongst these values are integrity, passion, innovation, and collaboration. Passion, innovation, and collaboration are important, but by far the most important of these is integrity, because the entire accounting profession is nothing without it. So it will be described further in the next slide. The main value of the AACPA is integrity. The organization states that they are committed to upholding the highest ethical standards to maintain trust and credibility with colleagues, members, and the public. Integrity is the cornerstone of the accounting profession, so it is no surprise that the American Institute of Certified Public Accountants places so much importance on it. According to Rule 102, Integrity and Objectivity of the AICPA Code of Conduct, the idea of integrity has many subcategories, three of them being misrepresentation, conflict of interest, and candidity. Protecting against misrepresentation includes detecting misstatements and knowing not to sign off on a document containing any false representation of material facts. Secondly, integrity entails avoiding conflicts of interest and remaining independent in fact and in appearance. Finally, the AACPA defines integrity by stating candidity. The organization encourages accountants to be candid and transparent with clients, managers, and external employees. Another core value of the AICPA is independence. Independence is specifically discussed in the AICPA's Code of Professional Conduct, Rule 101. Independence includes freedom from the influence, control, or determination of another or others. There is independence in fact and independence in appearance. According to the AICPA, accountants must exhibit both types of independence at all times. On the other hand, accountants must be objective and act with professional judgment by effectively applying knowledge, professional standards, and the codes of ethics. A newer adoption into the AACPA Code of Professional Conduct is the rule of due care. Due care encompasses a responsibility to observe professional and ethical standards, to continually improve upon competence and skills, and to work to the best of one's ability. This is important to allow accountants to know when it is necessary to refer work to another professional who might have a higher degree of competence in a certain area of an engagement. Most importantly, a person exercising due care should always be concerned with the best interests of the clients, consistent with the responsibility of the profession to the public at large. The culmination of every value and principle of the AICPA is prevalent within the CPA exam and licensure process. Because of the importance of the CPA licensing on the public, the AICPA has determined that the test alone is not significant enough for the CPA license, and instead there have to be four complete components in order to obtain the title of CPA. The four components are the exam, which has four parts, experience in the public accounting field, completion of higher education, as well as continued education, and finally ethics. All of this is put into place to ensure that the accounting industry maintains its integrity and reliability. The AACPA has increased its efforts towards student recruitment. They have done this through their website, thiswaytothecpa.com. 
Here, the AICPA offers a student affiliate membership, which opens the door to aspiring accounting professionals for scholarships, hands-on accounting experience, resume building, and networking opportunities. These accounting students have the opportunity to stay informed on changes within the accounting industry and take advantage of numerous resources in preparation for the CPA exam. And finally, these are the sources that we used for this presentation. Thank you very much.